Hello and welcome in this video for this exercise given during the Austrian Math Olympiad 2023. So this exercise is this one. Let x, y, and z be non-zero real numbers with x plus y over z equals y plus z over x equals z plus x over y. And you would like to determine all possible values of x plus y times y plus z times z plus x over x, y, z. So if you want to give a try, please pause the video. Otherwise, let's see the solution. So the idea is to add 1 on each side of the equality. So you end up with x plus y of z plus 1 equals y plus z over x plus 1 equals z plus x over y plus 1. So now you end up with x plus y plus z over z equals x plus y plus z over x equals x plus y plus z over y. So we are going to keep this. So now we can see two cases. So first case, this is the numerator x plus y plus z equals zero. Then you've got x plus y equals negative z. You put this quantity on the other side of the equation. And the same process, you've got y plus z equals minus x and z plus x equals minus y. Then you want to find out the value of this quantity. So you just plug and you end up with negative z times negative x times negative y over x, y, z equals negative x, y, z over x, y, z. And when you cancel out, you end up with negative 1. So the second case is the numerator x plus y plus z is different from 0. Then this is different from 0. So you take the, two, the first two terms. And now, because this is different from zero, you can divide by x plus y plus z on both sides of the equation, and you end up with 1 over z equals 1 over x. So now, you consider these two terms, and the same process, you divide by x plus y plus z. You can do that because it's different from 0. And you end up with 1 over x equals 1 over y. Then, by mixing these two uh, equations, you end up with 1 over x equals 1 over y equals 1 over z. And this is x equals y equals z. We stay with this, and now, now we can express this quantity x plus y function of x. For example, this is 2x, y plus z, this is 2x, and z plus x, this is 2x. So if you now multiply these three terms, you end up with 8 x cube over x cube and this is 8. So these possible values are negative 1 and 8. Thanks for watching this video and I hope to see you in the next one.